Hey everybody, welcome to Come Again TV, where all geek things collide. This is Billy once again, with your Funko Weekly Review. This week I am doing another underrated product that Funko does, and they are dorps. And a lot of people pass on these things because they don't, they're, like I said, they're just like the rock candies. They're not the classic Funko where you have the bobblehead or the fixed vinyl. They're called dorps because they're adorable. So stay tuned, and you will see why they are called dorps. Hey guys, welcome back to Comigan TV, where all geek culture collides. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. First up, we have the Flaming Skullhead himself, Ghost Rider. As you see, these are very adorable. They are kid, kid friendlier. They're not scary. They're not intimidating. But they're called dwarves because they are adorable. And they're very, it looks like it's very easy for them to make. There's not very much work that has to go into them. They can use almost the same mold for everything, everybody. And they just go in and put in the different hairstyles that each one has if they need to be. And just repaint them. But it's just a different mold for the hair. Like, like, with, it's an adorable Ghost Rider. Like, he came up and tried to do a pen and stare to me. I would just, I, I'd just giggle. Next up, we have the Walmart exclusive Batman the Animated Series Two Face. Like the, like with uh, Ghost Rider, they. Used the same body for the most part, repainted it, did different type style of hair mold for him. They added his coin down here in his hand. I'm not sure. You can there you go. Now you can see it. But one side's just smooth, and the other side actually has a cross in it, which is pretty cool to show the different sides. But like I said. They basically, they just use the same, same body, same head, they just repaint them. But they're still, they're adorable. It's like, this Two-Face would not scare me either. Next up, we have the X-Men's own intellectual genius. And Blue Monkey. <laughs> uh, Beast. He's not a monkey, I'm not sure exactly if he's supposed to be like a werewolf crossover, but Beast is cool. I like Beast. With him, they had to do a little bit different because of his ears. So I'm thinking they added those on with his hair. And you can see what it looks like right in here. How they glue the hair on right there the different types of molds. But it's basically the same mold. They just had to do something else with his ears. So they probably have a different... Probably the trolls. The troll hunter ones, they probably use the dwarves. The dwarves model to make them based off of the beast. And Nightcrawler, and I'm not sure who all came in this line. So with him, the only one I could see that they could probably... No, like, nobody else in the line that this one came in has pointy ears like that, so... I'm not sure which if they did anything else with that mold or not. And lastly, we have the Pirates of the Caribbean Disney Treasure Chest Box Exclusive Wicked... Winch Captain with Pirate Ship. This is not a ride. He is the Funko. This is an accessory. But the accessory itself, it's like it looks like he's it looks like Blackbeard almost. But this the, the boat itself is super cool. It's got the port can it's got the port and the starboard cannons on there, which are really cool. They did a really good job. Got the little Jolly Roger up here. Did a good job with the detail on this thing is really really good. Even down they got a rudder on there, which I I may end up keeping this one out of the box now because I did not realize how cool this thing looked. I may end up taking this to work and put it on my on my desk. But the captain has his little. He's got his sword out right there. He's got his little. Little bow ties. Oh, he does not have a hook hand though, so cool. He's not hooked. There is no trademark infringement there. Plus, Captain Hook with the long beard like that would look really weird. But, like I said, these things are called Dorbs. They're not like the original Funkos that they make. And I honestly, I, I kind of dig these little, little guys. So, thanks for watching. 
stay tuned next week for another Funko review. But, like I said, these guys live up to their name of Dorbs because they are adorable. So, stay cool. Make sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Leave your comments down below, and stay cool.